it's time for another update on what's going on in Prairie View, Texas. Hi, I'm Sherry Eccles, broker associate with Remax Bryan College Station. Things that we can see include that $80 million expansion at Flowchem. They're quietly building away. Next, the Checkers gas station and restaurants are going in on the southeast corner of University Drive and Highway 290. I'm not sure what the targeted opening date is, but that project looks pretty far along, don't you think? We can also see that new apartment complexes have gone up on both sides of Owens Road between University and James Muse Parkway. The Cricket Complex looks a little different every time I stop and check it out. I wonder when it will finally be complete. Things we can't see are the hotel and student housing coming up on this northeast corner of University and Highway 290 where the Frenchies used to be. No ground is broken yet, but we're waiting with bated breath. Housing is scheduled to go in on the Norris property behind the old bus station on Highway 290 business. Best use evaluation is going on regarding the southwest corner of James Muse Parkway and Highway 290. Will residential be best or something else? A $1.4 million grant has been awarded to a bidder to put in water and sewer, improving the infrastructure for all that growth that's to come. I know you're remembering that I have almost all the land between the Cricket Complex, Highway 290, and the football stadium listed. You may have seen my new signs up on that wrought iron fence. I've had some calls from interested parties and I'm working on a contract on one of the listings right now. So with any luck, I might have something new to report next update. Briata Creek is a new residential area going in in Hempstead with two acre lots and 500,000 plus homes. Heading north on Highway 6 from Hempstead, we see the development going in on that west corner and two new Chevron stations a few miles apart on the other side. Also, just about all the land on either side of Highway 6 is listed, meaning more development is going in that direction. No doubt due to the heavy traffic that Highway 36A is gonna bring through that area. That traffic will be able to go north up Highway 6, west toward Brenham, east right through Prairie View. This quiet little corner of the world is about to get very busy, like it or not. And finally, we need to talk about some student housing a little bit more. The current Prairie View A&M development plan goes through 2021 and lays out 12,000 student enrollment by 2021. In 2014, there were 8,300 students in the 18-19 school year, there were 95-16. The 19-20 enrollment isn't published yet, but we can see enrollment is heading steadily toward this goal. Four to five years ago, there was a 4,500 bed shortage for student housing. Since then, I believe apartments with approximately 2,000 bedrooms have been built. However, enrollment is already up 1,200, which by 2021 will be 5,200 more bedrooms needed. Then there'll be another university master plan that will include more growth. If you're interested in participating in some development in the area, please give me a call. I would absolutely love to serve you. This has been Sherry Eccles. Y'all here in Waller County really should sell with Sherry.